Not very good. I don't know what to say. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. Good evening. Just be normal. Don't panic. These people are your friends. Unless hanging out with me is just an inside joke between everyone. Because they actually hate me. And they get some sort of perverse gratification in seeing me think that we're all friends. Watching me be happy, excited, over something that isn't real. While silently laughing at the fact that I'm buying into their entire fabrication. God, I'm worthless. So why would these people want to actively be around me? Do they see something that I don't? Or am I only around so that everyone can feel better about themselves? Dude, shut up. It's all in your head. People have chosen to have you in their lives. I love these people. Hey Wes. You're gonna to have to get the fuck out. We can't keep acting like we actually enjoy having you around. Suicide hotline. I don't know what to do. I'm sitting here with all these pills and I'm just so sick and tired of everything. Do you live alone? I do. No wonder you want to kill yourself. So you're saying I should do it? I mean, not really, but is there anyone that comes by that can help you out? Well, there's this nosy fucking neighbor that never leaves me alone. So what that tells me is that you don't want to take pills. Because they'll find you and you'll just be in a lot of pain. And your organs will be shutting down. And then your neighbor will take you to the ER and they'll pump your stomach. So what do you recommend? Easiest way. Do you got a gun? I can't afford one. So you're looking for a suicide on a budget package. That sounds like what I need. Okay. Do you have any sturdy support beams or... Let me say, stop you right there. I've done so much damage to this apartment. There's just nothing that'll hold my weight long enough. Damn. So you lost your deposit? I've lost everything. I got you. Let me ask you one thing real quick. Do you have a severe allergy to anything in a room that locks? Almonds. And yes, I do. Problem solved. With our suicide on a dime package, we can send you a pack of almonds for the low, low cost of $49.99. And eventually your life. Can't I just go to the store? Okay, but do you really want to take that chance when we have a 100% satisfaction guarantee? Guaranteed? Absolutely, sir, and 
if that application doesn't work for you, we automatically upgrade you to our superstar package. Um, we basically send out a personal hitman to make sure we put you out of your misery. You are a lifesaver. Hey, that's the first time I've been called that. <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever told a story to someone and they were endlessly amused and when you brought it back up sometime later they claimed it was their own experience? Or you have heard someone tell the same story multiple times and each time it doesn't just have new flourish, it has new facts added simply just to make them sound more interesting. The best is when someone swears up and down they were part of the situation that you were in. And you know they weren't there. You remember every detail. And they weren't one of them. There are two truths in life. One. People are liars and cannot be trusted. No one is special despite what these self-indulgent creatures think. Just because you try and rewrite history doesn't mean it will work. The second truth is a small monthly payment of $19.99. Listen to the sound of my voice. Before we begin this transformation, may I ask that you please turn off all of the lights, find a comfortable place to lie down, and remove all of your clothing. Once you're situated, close your eyes, and take a deep breath as you prepare to emerge from the warm, ethereal bath in a state of perpetual alteration. Concentrate on the sound of my voice as it echoes through your mind. There is nothing in there aside from the sound of my voice. You have been tricked into believing that happiness is attainable through hard work and dedication. And as you begin to accept the realization of this fallacy, you will find yourself in a state of profound relaxation. So rest easy. Take a deep breath. And with each breath, each repetition, hold it in just a little while longer until you end up coughing violently, gasping for air. At this point, you will awaken an entirely new person. Allow my voice to crawl through your mind and into your soul. All of your deepest, darkest stories untold, I have been given access. Recording thoughts and motives 
all the while erasing them to alleviate your burden and still within you a new purpose by this time a malleable oxygen deprived brain will be calling out for help and luckily for you help has arrived and you can wake up